Yo boys and girls, welcome, well fucking come to uh, the channel. So today, as you can tell by the title and the thumbnail, we're going to be doing a bit of a Q&A. As we haven't done one for a long, long time on the channel. And also because I kind of want to revive this channel because it's a little bit dead at the moment. Alright guys, so first question of today's Q&A is by Emily. And her question is, what is one thing you cannot live without? Food. I can't live without food. Like, look at these scrambled eggs. By the way, the scrambled eggs you're looking at right now, it's actually the picture. It's been taken by me. This is my scrambled eggs. I can make scrambled eggs. I know, that's amazing. It's my blowing that two brain cells that are stuck in this head are capable of making a such sexy uh, scrambled eggs. Okay, so next question is by uh, Sneaky Bacon. This question is, what do you miss the most? about being a kid. A lack of responsibilities, lack of responsibilities because when I was a kid I could do whatever. I could come back from school, procrastinate, play video games, ignore all my homework. Even though kids do your homework, it's one of the most important things, as the aspects in your life. Yeah, don't listen to me. I'm just a kid with two brain cells. But to answer your question, the thing that I miss the most about being a kid is actually just the lack of responsibilities because now I actually have to go to a job and pay my bills. Where as a kid, I didn't have to pay my bills. All my bills were paid by my parents or well, my mum. <laughs> Okay, so next question is uh, by uh, Martin Smith, and this question is, if you won one million dollars playing the lottery, what would you do? Ho ho ho, one million dollars, that is a lot of money. So, first things first, I would get hella bitches. I'll tell you a little secret. First, I would invest the money, make more, become a Bill Gates 2.0, and then I would get all the bitches in the world. <laughs> so, next question is by Nexus Plays YT. YT is a fun game. So, the question is, what is your thoughts on the new YouTuber partner program rules? So, um, number one thing, I feel, I, for, to be honest, I already made a video about like if you guys want to go and check it out, uh, there will be a link in the i thing at the top of the screen and also in the description below. But just general outline of the thoughts. Um, I'm pro for it. Like it's great. It's it is gonna help all the big YouTubers. All the small YouTubers are gonna stop stealing cash from the people that are actually making a living from YouTube. And just generally, um, I feel like it's gonna bring a lot more positives and a lot more structure to this whole community. So next question is by Kenya. No question is, if there was an extra hour in the day, what would you do with it? I don't know. Extra hour? I'll probably sleep. Uh, much movie procrastinate just be myself and just let's go of all the important things I'll probably make that one hour just one of my chillax hours just like me time because generally sometimes throughout the days I actually have no time a quick example today I finished my essay but it took me two nights to write it I literally I haven't slept for two nights I had a couple of naps that's why I may look a little bit tired on today's video okay so next question is by a uh, little bean too and this question is what is your dream job uh, by the way nice video and welcome back uh, thank you Thanks. Thanks for welcoming me back because I love coming back to YouTube a lot of the times. <laughs> but in all seriousness, guys, um, my dream job is actually just being a content creator. I love creating content. I love, for example, making these vlogs, even though like this is not like being super creator. I just stand in front of my camera, uh, read some questions or talk about a specific topic and just be wild with my verbal skills and my dancing on the spot skills. But generally, I want to be a content creator, maybe a videographer, a potential director or maybe even a content creator on the site such as YouTube. I don't mind as long as I'm creating content, as long as it's something to do with visuals or uh, audio or anything that I can create and then post and let other people see and have their own opinion and judge it and give me feedback and how I can improve it, how I can make it better next time. That'll be a fantastic job because then what I could do is create whatever I want. No one's going to tell me what to do. I mean, so in the media industry, people do tell you what to do if you're not like high ranking person. But at the same time, um, generally, I just want to create things that I love create just content and just speak to for example you guys or any sort of audience out there that are potentially waiting for me in the future right now okay so next question is by Breezy and this question is opinion on a new snapchat update the snapchat update has been out for a little while now actually so my opinion on the snapchat update shit I don't like it it's horrible I still get it messed up especially when I'm drunk and I'm in the club even though I haven't gone clubbing for like three weeks maybe a month since I've actually posted the last video well not last video not the previous video a bit of video before that. I haven't been out clubbing since then. I really have to go out, but like when the new update came out, I was just like, there was this girl at the bar, and I was just like, hey, can I have your Snapchat? So she gave me her Snapchat. She was like taught, telling me what her Snapchat is, and I'm just like, but how do I add you? It was so awkward. So generally, I hate the new Snapchat because it made me have the most awkward conversation ever. And uh generally, um, 
I don't think I ever pulled that girl. I don't remember the rest of the night. So, um, yeah, but uh, I hate the new Snapchat update. So next question is by Mr. Ritzy. And his question is, what camera do you use? Also, I'm new to the channel. You have some great content, though. Keep it up. Thank you so, so much, bro. Thank you so much. So the camera I'm currently using is the Panasonic GS7. But if you go back into my older kind of style vlogs where, um, like, I don't know, like six months ago or something, I actually used a Canon 700D. Uh, this one I think it's called the T5i in the US and like the Australia and everywhere else except Europe but um, uh, this camera is great if you if you want this camera sure why not it's it's good but it's a little bit slow and focus and bad and low light Panasonic G7 a best camera I've ever had and I recommend it 100% so the next question or two questions is by uh, dark wolf one two three and his questions are what movies have you rewatched the most number of times so the movies I've actually rewatched the most number of times I I feel like is uh, the uh, Fast and Furious franchise. That is the franchise that I've actually watched the most number of times because every time a new uh, series or new franchise installment comes out, I actually go back to the first ever installment, Fast and Furious 1, or is the Fast and the Furious that it's called, and I literally watch them in order of the storyline until I get to the newest uh, franchise installment. And his next question is, what is your favorite movie? And my favorite movie at the moment is um, Baby Driver so far. Baby Drive is a great movie, fantastic movie, fast pace, a bit of like a love story, a bit of comedy, a bit of action, a bit of drama, a bit of everything put together when normally that doesn't actually work great within movies if you put so many things together but actually Baby Driver it worked so well. If you haven't watched Baby Driver I recommend it. Go watch it now. And the last and the final question is by uh, Kyle Gustav <laughs> Sorry mate I cannot say your last name but Kyle his question is is what kind of content are you planning to uh, post in the future? Also, welcome back. Thank you so, so much. So the content I'm planning to do in the future, well, I kind of, I've been planning this for a little while. I'm not sure when I'm going to start this, but my ideal kind of future adaptation of the content I'm currently doing is moving from static vlogs to more mobile vlogs in the sense that grab my camera, grab a tripod, and actually vlog my life, vlog my day, whatever I'm doing. But at the moment, my days are like, sometimes they're super fast paced and there's just too fast paced in the sense that I go from a point A to B, B to C, C to D. And then what ends up happening, I just end up forgetting to record any scenes, anything, and I'm having so much fun or sometimes there's so much grind that there's just no time for me just to hold the camera up, say a couple of things because I'm doing so much work. And on the other days, uh, which are the more of a procrastination days where I'm just being lazy just um, I get up I go to the gym really early in the morning and then afterwards what I do I possibly edit a video record one of these videos but then I don't have anything planned throughout the day so if I start vlogging my life and just general my day um, I end up having a really really boring vlog so I don't know when this is gonna come to the channel but that's my future plan hopefully maybe when I grow my YouTube channel a bit bigger or maybe when I finish university or maybe later on if I possibly move out of the place that I currently live at and maybe change my surroundings a little bit. But I mean guys, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to leave a like. If you really loved it, then make sure to subscribe. And if you missed the opportunity in today's video for your questions to be answered, then do make sure to put your questions down in the comment section below. I know I used to always ask you guys for questions on Twitter, but for all that time that I've actually been asking you guys all these questions on Twitter, there's so many of you guys messaging me on Discord, messaging me or even asking me on the in the comment section below saying, hey, can I ask you a question here and then I ended up having so many questions in so many random spots that I didn't really want to do it and I ended up isolating everyone from Twitter and kind of prioritizing everyone from Twitter uh, for this whole Q&A kind of videos but at the same time I want to include everyone and everyone actually has a YouTube account or a Google account that they can ask me questions in so if you have any more further questions uh, for the next q and I'm not sure when I'm gonna post it but for the next upcoming Q&A then do post them in the comment section below of today's video but in here guys it's still me blabbing on. I'm going to end this video here. So I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so, so much for watching. Take care, everybody, and bye bye. <laughs>